Hey guys, Vance Designs here with a brand new tutorial that was long awaited for some people. It is how to make the faded glowing flares or edges for backgrounds. So let's get started so that I don't keep you guys waiting. So what you want to do is make a new layer. Then you want to make the color, the foreground color white. Press the brush tool, make the size 3 and the hardness 0. Once you do that, go to your pen tool, click from one end, hold shift and press the other end to where, whatever distance you want. Once you do that, right click, press stroke path, make sure tool is on brush and simulate pressure is checked, press OK. Then right click again and delete path. Now what you have is the, the whole flare, now we just got to get it to look like one. So now you've got a, a fading from one end to the other and the middle is bold. So now double click on your, la on your layer with the faded line, and, or you can right click and go blending options. Double clicking is easier. So then go to outer glow, change the opacity to 70, change the color to match your background. So mine's green, so let's make that one green. Then what you want to do is change the size to 6 and the range between 22 and 30. In my opinion, the best ones are 25 or 30. So that's what 30 looks like. Let's stick with 30. So now that you have that, this is your flare basically. Now if you think the white's a little overpowering in the flare, in the faded glow, go to color overlay, make the color again the same color as your background and make it a light color of whatever it is. That just reduces the brightness of the white and also gives it a nice t adding touch. Now for edging, what you want to do, again, make a new layer. Now that you have your brush ready and everything, grab your pen tool, grab, press up one, hold shift, and then after that, hold shift and press down and try and get to the same size. So I'm just going to stick with that right now because I don't want it doesn't have to be perfect. So then go stroke path, and then what you have right now is the edging so if you don't know what i mean by edging it'd be something like right here in the corner yeah so that's what it would look like so now for this one what you want to do is again right click and go to blending options or double click on the layer to open up blending options go to outer glow again make it make it the same color as your background and basically just follow what I did for the first one. So put it on 70. I'll just repeat it for you guys. Put the size to 6. And this one will make it 25. So as you can see it gives it a nice glow. And again what I said. If the green and the white. The white's a little overpowering sometimes. Just go to color overlay. Make the color whatever color your background is. And make it a light color of that. So as you can see, it just dull, it just makes it a little better. It makes it look like it's glowing around the whole shape. So guys, I hope the, this long-awaited tutorial was was worth it. Hope you guys liked it. If you if this helped you and you were one of the people that were waiting so long for this tutorial, which I'm sorry about, please like the video and also comment what else you want to see. I have some good news, I have an update video coming up and also some more backgrounds I need to show you which are really awesome, I've been making some for a while now. So I have about like 6 or 7, <laughs> what am I kidding, I probably have like 15 more that I'm ready to show you guys. So thanks for watching guys, again please like the video if it helped and have a great day.